Hello, what up, the sup? I'm Misha, and this is Misha C. Tarot. I hope you're doing wonderful. All praises due to the Most High. Did it go out? Ooh, ooh. I truly appreciate every last one of you for joining me. Returning subscribers. New subscribers, y'all, that's just stopping by. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, as well as the notification bell. That way you'll be notified for new content. God, I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, angels and ancestors of the Most High, the White Light. Please, God, protect us as we go into the tarot and allow me to chat a clear and honest messages from whomever may come across this reading. What do they need to know and what do they need to hear? Holy Spirit, what important messages do you have for the collective today? What important messages do you have for the collective today? This came out in my pre-show and it's out again. Okay, we have here mastering. Right? And then with this low vibration right here, right? I'm definitely feeling like somebody's been in a low vibration so long. That's like their only... <laughs> it seems like that's the only frequency they know how to be in. As I split the deck, we have here sharing skirts. I might could definitely be two masculines could definitely be sleeping with the same woman. Right after sharing skirts, we have here this shit is crazy. All right, as well as the Sagittarius could be very significant. You could be a Sagittarius. This could be someone else. It could be happening around you. So be sure to take only what resonates and leave the rest. Tell me more, Holy Spirit, mastering. Sharing skirts. Mastering. Somebody's become a pro at something here. Somebody's favorite color could be yellow. This is crazy. This is too much. Oh, this is too much going on. We have your hot pocket. So somebody could definitely be dealing with a UTI, STD, burning, itching, scratching, travel, whatever. Okay. But like I said, with this sharing skirts, sharing skirts as well as hot pocket coming out. Okay. Or this could definitely just be somebody that has bad hygiene. All right. Somebody like any yoni, you know, something like that. Anyways, yeah. You could have met this person at a social event, okay? Some type of party, gathering, clubbing, outing, okay? Somebody could also work at a bar, all right? Waitressing, a casino, something like that. A restaurant. This shit is crazy. This is wild. This is going to be a whole lot. Somebody went out their way to, like, really seduce this person here with go out of my way. Okay, with this go out of my way, this person really went out their way to seduce this person. You got to be careful about, it's like, somebody's very suspicious about somebody that was just very too revealing. Like, they could have told you all about their life, all about their business and what they had going on. All right, it's like somebody could talk too much. All right, they could have said too much in their first encounter with this person. Tell me more, Holy Spirit, hot pocket, sharing skirts. This is going to be, this is going to be. Some kind of read. All right. I'm just saying. <laughs> From the way it's looking right about now. Okay. And we also have here the horse. I'm definitely getting like Texas with that. Or somebody could live in a rural area. It's also giving me like sexual energy as well, too. Clearing on this messages, Holy Spirit. The year of the horse could be significant as well. Clearing on this message with Holy Spirit. Nothing at the bottom and nothing at the top. We have your speaking facts, saying it with your chest. Mm. So something that somebody perceived as petty gossip, gossip and wasn't true was actually true. Okay, somebody could be late. Their period could be... I mean, their period could be late. Yeah, yeah, actually. <laughs> that's what I meant to say. Their period could be late. <laughs> it came out of my mouth before it even registered. Their period could be late. Somebody could actually be pregnant by this 
person, this masculine, that is sharing skirts. All right. We also have here, they don't know. So somebody hasn't told someone that they've conceived or they're pregnant. Or somebody hasn't realized that they've missed their period or they haven't had a period. They haven't had a menstruation. Okay, this could be some type of news or information that's going to affect somebody's foundation, all right, or stability. But we also have here telling it like it is, all right, with this speaking facts and saying it with your chest. Whatever this person's doing, saying, they're telling the fucking truth. And man, motherfuckers may not want to hear it, but they telling it like the fuck it is. For real. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Wow, that is that's deep. All right, because we go from petty, we go from speaking facts. Something perceived as petty gossip was actually someone telling it like the fuck it is here, and somebody could have just thought they were just gossiping, or like they always got some shit to say, or they didn't feel like they knew what this person was talking about. I'm definitely getting like somebody could be a gossiper here, but the shit that they be talking about actually be the fucking truth. But everybody think they just be in everybody's business. Somebody's like, why do you always know the motherfucking tea? Somebody could be mad or irritated with somebody because they always got the tea. Like, what the fuck? Wow, we have your male sitting at the top of my dick. I can't make it up. Has something to do with a masculine. For some of you guys, you haven't slept with this person. You could have just tongued this person down. Or they could have tongued you down. All right. And then we have here, it slash we got deeper than expected. Okay, with this male hissing and masculine here, this masculine that is just meeting someone new, it's this person that they're meeting here is starting to fall for them. I don't, yeah, this person is definitely starting to fall for them, but they have a whole lot going on. There is some type of disease that is being shared, all right? It's also just to be somebody's hygiene, but with this STD, UTI, hot pocket, like somebody shit fucked up right now. Okay? Because motherfuckers around here sharing skirts here. Somebody actually didn't get their period. Their period is... I'm, the administration has not came here. Somebody doesn't even know that they could actually have a child on the way. Or somebody doesn't know that they're pregnant. Okay? This shit is crazy. This shit is crazy. I hardly ever get this card, but this shit is crazy. It's mind-blowing. All right? Motherfuckers be acting like shit like this don't be going on. The fuck it do? Because it wouldn't be here in the collective energy. Somebody was giving too soon. Okay? Anything else overall this spirit? We're in this situation. We have here healthcare. Come through the fuck spirit. The fuck? We have here healthcare. Somebody needs to go see the peoples. Go see a gyno. A doctor. Okay? Clearing on this messages, Holy Spirit. One more. Come on, needs to go. Clearing on this message, just please. That was a lie. Ooh, they just flying out. Okay, Holy Spirit, just come on with it. Clearing on this message. Last message. Come to the tarot. Somebody could actually, I actually feel like, like somebody could be like watching somebody like they're the fucking police. All right, they're the fucking feds, okay, or some shit like that. Like, top private eye around this motherfucker. We have here marriage and children. So this person is married, or have been in a very long commitment with somebody, but and this person has children. Okay, that won't be for everybody, but somebody is married and somebody also has children here. You know what the fuck going on? Baby. I'm just definitely getting like, not only is this person not protecting their self, they're not protecting their family or this person here. Like somebody could have brought something home with them and I ain't talking about no motherfucking baby. Okay. Tell me more about mastering Holy Spirit sharing skirts. Somebody's like a master at this. Like, they truly fucking be fucking, period. They get the fuck around. Motherfucker, this, I'm, I don't know why I'm getting this here. Somebody could have fucked some cousins, all right? So some friends, a group of friends, okay? Tell me more about mastering and sharing skirts, Holy Spirit. 
Somebody knew they had a fucking STD, all right? Because right after STD, we got here going out my way. So you knew you had some shit going on, but you chose to fucking do it anyway. We have here the full card with the five of cups. Like somebody's walking around here carefree. Lusting after people. Tell me what? The page of swords. Like, motherfuckers, it's definitely somebody out here picking their victims, period. I'm going to just tell you that right now. It might as well be if you know you got some shit going on. Tell me more about the page of swords here. Somebody could like to date people and somebody likes to be in the family here. I don't even. Uh. The page of wands, the full card, the page of swords, the page of wands, the three of swords, the seven of wands. For some of you guys, you guys are hit. Rejection is protection here. So somebody could have rejected you, tried to make you feel some type of way, but this rejection was actually your protection or you can go vice versa. Take it how it resonates here, but this rejection was for your protection, okay? Woo! Okay, so this is definitely going on between somebody that's around you, collective. <laughs> All right, now everybody's story is different, but this is definitely happening to somebody that's around you. These people with the sharing skirts here, the page of ones, the page of swords, these people could have seen one another and they could have seen this male, this masculine in action, all right? They could have definitely caught these two people together or somebody could actually know about each other or know that they're sleeping with the same person. Tell me more about the page of ones, page of, short, page of swords, going out my way, hot pocket. Somebody could be talking about Somebody been spreading some shit or some shit like that here. Yeah, the Eight of Wands here with the Nine of Pentacles. These are a lot of single people doing some wild shit. Yeah, but with this Eight of Wands here, hot pocket going on my way, Eight of Wands, like this person literally took action towards somebody. Like, I don't give a fuck. Like, somebody's acting like a straight... Horn dog, period. Anything else? We have here the chariot in reverse with the star card and the emperor. Okay, truth be motherfucking told here. This person tried to pass something to you or give something to you, whether that be spiritually, okay, infected, okay, or actually infected with some type of uh, STD. All right. Somebody could also be like going to jail for this shit too, because somebody could actually know that they're infected. And they're just still out here not giving a fuck about their life or anyone else's life. No, I ain't always about to go there today. But let's keep that shit fucking real, okay? With the chariot here in reverse. One of these motherfucking people ain't motherfucking playing. They're sharing skirts here with the chariot in reverse. Tell me more about the chariot in reverse, Holy Spirit. Somebody could have tried, yeah, and I'm definitely getting that. Somebody could have tried to say that they got an STD from somebody, but that motherfucker don't got it, so they didn't ever get it from this person. It's like somebody could be trying to put the blame on someone and someone else doesn't even have it. They're the ones that have it, so that's not where you got it from. The Nine of Pentacles with the Six of Wands, all right? This person could have tried to like, wow, this could be like not want nobody else to want you, not want you to feel good about yourself and loving on yourself, all right? Somebody wanted you to not like the skin that you were in, all right? Somebody tried to literally infect you or infect somebody around you here. Yes, with the three of pentacles here and the king of swords, like somebody's like, they thought this up, mastering, all right? Whatever they tried to, whatever play they tried to make, it's it's failing here. It's backfiring. What happened at the social event? Why is the social event here, Holy Spirit? Clarify social event. Somebody could have came across this person here with the devil card at the bottom of the deck, the ace of pentacles. I'm also getting like somebody rejecting the offer. Okay, with the six of swords and the high priestess here, you could have definitely picked up on something very fishy, very conniving, all right, about this person, very dark, okay? Something wasn't right. It just didn't feel right. You could have rejected this person. Tell me more about the Ace of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. We have here the Eight of Pentacles in reverse with the Three of Wands, but the Eight of Pentacles is uh, upside down. So whatever plan or plot this person thought that they was going to have on someone, it didn't work. 
It's almost like somebody just doesn't want to put any effort into anything. All they just want to do is like sleep around. Definitely want the Eight of Pentacles. In reverse, Ace of Pentacles. We have here the Eight of Cups in reverse. With the Seven of Wands here. So somebody wouldn't take no for an answer. Somebody's a very, the aggressor. Like they were very aggressive in their approach here. I'm definitely getting like somebody very sexual. Or they sexualized everything or everything was always about sex. What is I'm late? Somebody always want access to you. It's almost like if they're not sleeping with you, then they don't want to deal with you. You're not giving it up. Then they don't give a fuck. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. I'm late. Clarify I'm late, please. Am I too late? I'm do this again because, man. Am I too late? Holy Spirit, 1616 on the top. Am I too late? We have here the Seven of Swords. Like, wow, with the devil card here. Like, somebody who deliberately was trying to get someone pregnant. Somebody, like, did not want to miss their opportunity window. So somebody could be playing like they don't know that someone is pregnant or they don't know that they gave someone an a, a STD. But the fuck they did. Somebody's had this STD for a long fucking time with the Ace of Swords following that. All right. As well as the Six of Wands. Like this motherfucker always got some shit going on. And then they walk around this bitch like they don't know. The Seven of Swords, the Devil card. The Eight of Wands. Clarify the Seven of Swords, Devil card, Holy Spirit. I don't know. Somebody could be acting like they don't know that they get got this. It's almost like this person, somebody's finding out that they're pregnant and that they have an STD. Or this could be somebody that has an STD. This could be somebody that's finding out that they're pregnant. There's a main male, all right, that's in a new relationship with somebody and it's getting a lot deeper than expected. But this person don't even know that this male got all this shit going on somebody could also be married and have children and be fucking like just out here living in a single they single old best motherfucking life here like they ain't got a whole ass family somebody also gonna be going to motherfucking jail too for spreading all this spreading this std around whatever the fuck however the fuck and man anyways tell me more holy spirit Devil card, seven of swords, I don't, they don't know. We have here the death card with the ten of cups here. Yeah, somebody has a family that doesn't know about what the fuck they be doing here. Somebody's like literally out here embarrassing their fucking family, their their marriage. Yeah, they don't respect their marriage, they don't respect their person. They could be like seeing their person out in public here and their motherfuckers seeing them with the whole ass family. And some of uh, some some motherfuckers just too embarrassed to say anything, or they could be chuckling or laughing or giggling here. Somebody could have heard something about your husband in the in the fucking community, in the neighborhood. And somebody thought it was petty gossip, but it was actually a fucking fact. Something's coming to an ending here. Tell me more, Holy Spirit, the death card. They don't know. We have here the Ten of Wands, the Three of Wands with the Six of Cups here. Somebody's going to be pleading and, begging, pleading and begging because they don't want to lose their family. Somebody also has a child outside of the marriage. Clearing on some messages, Holy Spirit, for this male. Clarify this male. We have here the three swords with the ten of wands. Almost like somebody wants to hurt people like they've been hurt. Clearing on about this male. We have here the Nine of Cups here, the Queen of Wands, as well as the Sun card. So this person is taking pleasure in this, all right? They're glad to do this. They're happy to do this, okay? Somebody ain't got no motherfucking shame. They ain't got no fucking shame. 
Okay, the Nine of Cups, the Queen of Wands, the Sun card. They feel like they're a gift to every woman. They feel like they're a gift to every man. All right. I'm definitely getting like somebody has no self-control here. Okay, with this devil card here, the seven of swords, eight of wands, the nine of cups, the queen of wands. Somebody has no self-control as far as like period or sexually. They just can't control themselves. Tell me more about the knight of nine of cups, the queen of wands. The six of wands with the ace of swords. That's the motherfucking truth. Ace of Cups, the Two of Pentacles with Judgment here. This person's definitely going to be receiving some type of harsh judgment here. Because with the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Swords, the Ace of Cups here, the Two of Pentacles, somebody's like gladly walking around handing some shit out. Okay, the Queen of Swords, the Four of Cups here, the Five of Pentacles, and the Star. Somebody is upset here that you reject them or they couldn't get you. If this isn't you, this could be happening to somebody around you, all right? Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, yeah, all right? They say, don't say those things. Don't say those things. Don't say those don't say those things. Like somebody is completely shocked. Like somebody does not want somebody to speak this fact, speak this truth, say this shit with their chest. But we also have here telling it like the fuck it is. Something is not gossip. Something is actually the truth. Somebody doesn't want to hear the fucking truth. Okay, a Scorpio could be significant as well as a Capricorn, Gemini, a Cancer, a Leo, an Aries. Tell me more Holy Spirit as well as a Pisces. Time flies when you're having fun, all right? A Libra, have your Libra at the bottom of the deck, and two nights, okay? So two nights ago, two nights from now, all right? We'll be seeing this in two nights, and then we also have here, once again, at the top of the deck, low vibrational energy as well as a snake. Somebody's a fucking snake, okay? Somebody could also be doing this for money, all right? Or they could be seeing somebody, and they're paying somebody to do something with them for money, okay? We have here the power of money. Anything else, Holy Spirit, regarding the situation? Wow, wow, wow. We have here taking a risk, and then we have here, I made a mistake. So after it's all said and done, this person has realized that they've taken a risk and they've made a mistake. Mm -hmm. That's so sad. That is so sad, y'all. Wow. As I pick up my deck, the last card that I didn't grab was threesome and orgy. And then we have here, find yourself. Mm, 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 mm. I'm going to leave it right the fuck there. Right the fuck there. Because, um... I love you. I'm sending you the utmost love and respect. Peace, healing, joy, prosperity, abundance, love, and hell of that shit. Peace.